welcome to Caden's minute long extravaganza. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to paint. So the colors you'll be needing is brown, green, black, gray, blue, uh, I think it's yellow, and uh, red. So today our model is Ethan, no last name. All right. All right, so I've been painting for about three hours now. How are you feeling, Ethan? Okay. All right, let's get back into it. So anyway, guys, that's how you paint a picture. I didn't put up forth my greatest effort, but I did put some into it. Hopefully you guys like it. If not, I expect some criticism in the hallways. Well, that's that. Let's go off to another segment. Yes. Yes, Ms. Coles, I have your segment for this week's BLT announcements. Yep. Okay. Goodbye. Hey, guys. I'm here with your guys' quote of the week. Now, if this relates to you, please take 100% offense to this. <clears throat> I walk around like everything is fine, but deep down in my heart, inside my shoe, my sock is sliding off. Now, I know how uncomfortable this is, and I will show you right now. All right, guys, as you can see, my sock is sliding off of my foot, and it's pretty uncomfortable, but I don't know what to do about it. As you have just seen, there are countless numbers of students who suffer from sock sliding off feetism. If you're one of these students, please contact me immediately. Now, the significance of this quote is to tell you that you should probably be wearing longer socks. Now, what would you do if you had short socks and was suffering from sock sliding off feetism? Okay, um, let's go to uh, whoever we got next. Hey guys, welcome to your first Kobe's Wacky and Cool Q&A, as in question and answer. Let's waste no time. Let's just let's just jump right into it. Let's just get our first question here. What is the funniest memory you have from your high school years? Probably when I went to state for cross country. I did not stop laughing. <laughs> I did not stop laughing when I did that. All right, you know what? Next question. Why aren't iPhone chargers called Apple Juice? Well, because if you probably, probably if you drink that stuff, I don't know what's in it to charge the phones, but if you drink that stuff, it'd probably be fatal. And I wouldn't recommend it. Let's, let's get another one, guys. Do you still play Pokemon? I never played Pokemon. Let's go to the next one. How do you have so much clout despite no longer being the principal's son? I'm really glad someone asked this question because my dad is still the principal just not here at Edgerton local schools I'm not allowed to give out any information as to where he's at now but just know he's still principal and I'm still the principal's son I'm getting word that it's about time to stop but probably actually not so let's do one more actually I'm gonna I'm gonna hand this one off to uh, Ethan Let's just, oh, thanks, uh, Toby. Yeah. I'll take that right from you. All right, let's go, guys. All right, guys. We got this question here. Now I'm going to go around and ask people what they think, or if they could have any superpower, what would it be? All right, here we go. All right, guys, we're still out here looking for people to interview. Well, I don't really see anyone around here. Oh, here's a couple guys. Hey, you want to be in an interview? Yes. Okay. Here's the question. If you could have any superpower, what would it be? The ability to skate fast. Okay. Uh, um, I would like to uh, uh, ride roller blades. I can't roll a blade. Wow. That's a great superpower. All right, thanks for being in the interview. Right, let's go, guys. Let's see if anyone's in here. Oh, hey, guys. You want to be in an interview? Sure. Yeah. All right. Um, if you could have any superpower, what would it be? Flying. Okay. Invisibility. Okay. Time travel. Very nice. 
teleporting. Okay. Mind reading. I don't know. Everybody took we need mine, to redo so, it. Redo uh, it. Invisibility. All right. Thank you, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Well, looks like we've hit a dead end, guys. I guess I'll ask myself the question. If I could have any superpower, what would it be? Probably to be able to tie my shoes all by myself. All right, that's it for this Ethan's epic interview. Off to the next guy. Hey, guys. Now, for my segment, we're going to be trying the uh, chicken nuggets from Dairy Queen and the McDouble from McDonald's. Let's jump right into it, right? First bite. Tastes pretty good, you know. Mm. The cheese and the bun and the bread and the burger go together great, you know. Now, the chicken nuggets from Dairy Queen. Let's try them out. This one kind of looks like a whale. I don't know. Maybe it's whale meat? I don't know. It's also pretty good, you know, but maybe a nugget burger. That's pretty good. Now, I'd recommend both of them. And that's it. See you guys.